So I'm actually really excited to see how um, your experience of the first game or your first impression of the game changes your opinion. Mm -hmm. Because the way that I feel about certain character, certain characters, and certain things mm -hmm. is mostly based on how I experienced it first. Mm -hmm. uh, fun fact: I took the other route. Ah. I went through door number five my mm -hmm. first time through. Interesting. Yeah. Hey there, welcome back to 999. Uh, I got a matchbook. Or you can search things. Oh, yeah. It's a box of matches. There are matches inside, obviously. Not obviously. Mm -hmm. Alright. Oh! Oh! Junpei looked down blankly at what he was holding, then up at June. Eh. <laughs> oh, yeah. Um, how's your fever? Uh, you feeling better now? Oops, sorry. <laughs> oh, someone didn't put their phone in silence. And we're... someone forgot to turn on the timer. So, so we're you know both what? At fall. It's you fine. know what? It's a wash. Um, yes. I'm feeling fine. Jun certainly looked fine. Mm. Hella fine. Dabu did though. Yeah. Jun beheld his hand on her forehead for a few seconds, just an excuse to touch her. Mm -hmm. It seemed her fever really had gone down. Are you worried about me? Ooh. Hey, Kenny. Uh, are you worried about it? or Hey, come on! It's not like that! Heights erection. That's, like, kind of douchey. This is less douchey. Yeah, I, I, I guess I am. <laughs> <laughs> you know what's really cute? When a really cute character has a horrible laugh. Kind of like, like a... a <laughs> no, 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 like, what's the name of that girl from Persona F Golden for... Chi? Yukiko? Yukiko, yeah. yeah. <laughs> Just like... <laughs> yep. I do that She's sometimes. a baby laugh. She's a baby laugh. <laughs> <laughs> June blushed and giggled. Um, by the way, Jumpy? I love her determined sprite. Right. Um... How did you end up here? Um, what do you mean? Uh, I told you earlier, uh, didn't I? When my mom and dad loved each other very much, they had a baby. <laughs> Back when my mom and dad loved each other a lot. <laughs> There was a man with oh, a gas me. mask. Oh. There was a man with a gas mask when you got home at night. You inhaled some white smoke and passed out. You smoked some weed and passed out. And when you woke up, you were on D-deck. Wait, didn't, didn't we already make the joke that Junpei's like an art major? <laughs> we don't remember. Right? Is the flannel yeah. that really makes me like, yeah, art major, right? Yeah. Yeah, it's like now that it's legal, he's just like smoking smoke, it up all smoke day. Smoke weed every day. I think this story can only take place in like... 20, like, 17 or something, or 20, like, 20-something. 20 uh, no wonder. <laughs> oh, yeah, that explains everything. That does explain yeah, absolutely. everything. Absolutely. In this dystopian reality in which people but, kidnap people to put on uh, boats. You know what? You know what? That's a little bit too real for me. <laughs> I know. Yeah, right? uh, yeah uh, th that's it. But is that really the truth? Um, what? Jumpy, are you hiding something from me? Aside from the erection? Uh, no! Uh, w uh, why would I? Well... If you think about it, this is awfully suspicious. I mean, why would two childhood friends bump into each other in a place like this? Destiny? <laughs> mm -hmm. Hey, I could just I could ask you the same thing. Are you hiding something? Um, what would I hide? Well, I don't know. I mean, anything. I mean, uh, you, you're hiding. Uh, I mean, you you're hiding it. How would I know? That's that's, yeah. that's a that's a dumb line, but yeah. You mean like the number of men I've dated? That's such a Japanese thing to say. Mm -hmm. Jimbe's heart stumble, st stumbled over itself. Do you want to know? <laughs> that determined Sprite. He had to admit, he was a little curious. Don't worry. He smi she smiled at him. Only 18. <gasps> Masaka! Time zero. Yeah, I guess I haven't met Mr. Right yet. <laughs> June looked a little embarrassed and scratched the back of her head in a desperate attempt to seem nonchalant. Or maybe I'm gay. <laughs> or both. Yeah. Junpei coughed, coughed quietly in much the same way. Anyway, I'm not hiding anything. Just like you said, Jumpy. When I woke up, I was on D-deck. Well, uh, you do have a point. I mean, why did Sierra pick us? We haven't seen each other since elementary school. June nodded, and for a few moments, she had the faraway look of someone in deep thought. Hmm. Look for what connection connects the victims. That Then you will find the culprit. That's what Seven said. Do you remember Seven saying something like that? Uh, y yeah, I do. So? Well, that's what I'm saying. I think this must have something to do with a classmate of yours. You got any ideas who it might be? No, nothing. 
oh, <laughs> thinks of like uh, high school mm. yearbook as like the one millionaire kid. Mm. It's basically Dio. Or the one really creepy kid. The one really creepy kid, yeah. Everyone had one of those. Uh, well, that's me. Oh. Well, if it had something to do with our school, then it could be one of our teachers or maybe the principal. You know what I would really like this game to have? Mm. Like, colored names mm. so you kn knew who was talking yeah because it always that always trips me up every time mm -hmm. i know this game is like ancient mm -hmm. and i get that but like or like colored text boxes or just like a little something to be like okay mm -hmm. this color is this person you mm -hmm. know or the janitor or the lunch lady that lady fucking hated me no i can barely remember any of them <laughs> yeah I, I i know hmm, hmm. even the narrator's like hmm Junpei went back to searching, feeling, oh, to searching, feeling unpleasant and confused. There should be a comma. Yeah, there. should be a comma there. You're the comma queen, Kitty. Mm -hmm. Elementary school. Elementary school. Was there anything strange that had happened in elementary school? Yo, I can't even fucking remember elementary school. I I, I remember so little. Yep. And, and all my memories are in Spanish, which makes it way weirder. <laughs> uh, she so searched the room. <laughs> There's some really bad stereotypical jokes you could make there. <laughs> <laughs> there are just cactus everywhere. Mm. That's not even true. No. Half of Mexico is not even like it's temperate weather anyway. <laughs> As he searched the room, he continued to wa to ra rack his brain. Rack it. There you go. Nice little thoughtful moment. Let's take a nap on this couch. Oh. Jumpy, what are you doing? We don't have the time to be relaxing on the sofa. Okay. Uh, it's a display case, but there's nothing being displayed. How sad. Looks like the drawers are empty, too. Oh. Into the door. And it's bed. Uh, that bed looks like it fucking sucks. Good night. It's like a, it's like a, like a baby bed for, for, for people. I wouldn't mind, kind of. Except getting out of it yeah, would be hard. Yeah, or heading, getting in the air. I, yeah. I just love rolling into bed. I feel that. It's a light blue blanket with some designs on it. Someone's made the bed, or at least never unmade it. There's only bed sheets under the blanket. Nothing exciting. But what about the pillows? Oh, look, uh, there's two pillows right next to each other. Guess it's a uh, double. <laughs> um, what's up? You're turning red. Yeah, I'm thinking about fucking oh, you. Oh, man. Is her fever back? No, I'm just having dirty <laughs> thoughts. Uh, hey, uh, are you all right? <laughs> just <laughs> thinking about riding your disco stick. Yep. Uh, Lady Gaga's lyrics just always... Mm -hmm. uh, uh, they always resonate with me. I want you know, to take I, a ride on your disco on stick. On your disco stick, yeah, absolutely. Yep. Do what you want. Do what you want with my body. Mm -hmm. Do what you want. Don't stop this party. Yep. <laughs> I fucking love that song. I listen to it every morning when I'm when I'm like washing my face and mm -hmm. like and just like putting on makeup. I'm like, yeah, this song inspires me. <laughs> you need to lay that. Do you uh, need to lay down for a minute? Only with you. Uh, I mean, I'm fine. <laughs> uh, I love her, like the her hair. hair like, yeah. yeah. The sprites are so good. It, I think it's still a little early for that. Huh? Oh, I mean, I guess we should probably do first and second base before third, I guess. Hey, seriously, uh, are, are you really okay? I'm fine. Oh, I gotta go. Uh, look at this grandma's ashes right there. My favorite. This isn't a painting. It's a, a map. Helps to have a map. Helps to have a map. It looks like a map of the ship's interior. Oh, this is a great find. I, I think it will be really useful. Let's take it with us. He takes the photo frame. You can't, <laughs> yep. Carries it under his arm. Yep. It is not possible to use the map screen. Oh my god, we have a map. It does help to have a map. Map screen. Uh, the map screen can only be blah 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 blah. You can only view it during the sections, not during the story. Blah blah blah. We're to tell you about the story. The stuff. It's the stuff with the map and the words on it. And you look at it with And stylus and the green parts and the bird's eye. All right, we good. Never mind. We gotta look at the map now. Jumpy to... I mean, they, they're going to bring up a couple of really important things. Mm. Junpei took one last look at the map, then folded it up and, sli and slid it back into his pocket. Mm. Oh. Jun, Jun looked up as he closed it. The fact that their names are so close... Yeah, that doesn't like, that, that bothers me. That bothers me. The ship is bigger than I thought. Uh, yeah, it's probably 900 feet long. How do, how do we have any sort of point of reference for that? Maybe there's a measure thing on the map. Mm. Yeah. Must be one of those fancy cruise ships. Uh, course? Like, like of course, but shortening it down. Oh, I guess. Course. But nobody says that. Mm. Cause is people something say. Mm. Instead of because, mm. cause. Course? 
Uh, totes instead. Yeah. Totes. It doesn't really look like a cruise ship. Everything in here is really retro. Uh, even if uh, even if it's some sort of style choice, there's just too much. Do you remember what Zero said? Do I play a game? On April 14, 1912, the famous ocean liner Titanic crashed into an iceberg. After remaining afloat for two hours and 40 minutes, the exact length of the movie by that guy, I forget his mm, name, mm. it sagged beneath the waters of the North Atlantic. That movie feels like it's two hours and 40 minutes. <laughs> That's for sure. Do you think maybe this boat and the Titanic have something to do with each other? Hmm... I don't know, this theming seems a little strong, but that is a good point. I doubt he would have mentioned that if there was if there wasn't a reason. Now just to throw you off. Jumpy took a moment to look around the room. Do you think this boat is Do you think it's a replica of the Titanic or the actual Titanic, Kitty? Well it's in decent shape, so I would say a replica probably. I mean what do you think? Yeah, I would say a replica. Hmm. It'd be weird yeah. if it was the actual Titanic. A replica of the Titanic? A replica? Yeah. You know, like a copy of the actual boat. You know what the word means. Who on earth would make something like that? Fans? Crazy Titanic fans? <laughs> no way! He makes a point. Mm -hmm. Do you know how much money that would even take? No idea. I have no fucking clue. I am broke as fuck. <laughs> He's an I, art student. I, I eat top major. ramen every day. Every night. <laughs> but that's how I have this figure. Mm -hmm. But... But all they've got to do is break even, you know? Break even? Yeah. Uh, they could use it as a cruise ship. Climb aboard a piece of history. Sail around the world in the resurrected Titanic. I don't think this will go over well. Hell, with marketing like that, they'll probably have more customers than they'd know what to do with. Do you really think people would want to go on a... To want to ride on a ship with such an ominous past? It's the site of the worst accident in history. I don't know about that. Over 1,500 people died. I wouldn't be surprised if you get cursed just for going. Oh, it curses. Yeah, that's such a Japanese thing. Yeah. Curses. A curse? Huh. Jumpy, do you believe in that sort of thing? You know, curses and stuff. Do you believe in curses, Junpei? No, I think they're a little crap. Um, Are you going to disagree with her? I mean, you should agree with everything she says, right? Because you want to get in her pants. But yeah, yeah. then again, you should really just be honest, kitty. Relationships are built in honesty. It's true. And, and lies. A lot of lies. Mm hmm um, me personally, fuck yes I do. Jump, jump, jumpy. As an art major? As an art major. Smoking weed every day? 420 blazing cool. Sorry, but I, mean, I can't really say I believe in that kind of stuff. Tact was not one of Jumpy's <laughs> many better qualities. Uh, what about you? Oh, oh, wait. No, I th no it's just still Junpei. Oh, what about... He's answering what about his own question. What about you? Nah, I guess that's kind of a dumb question. Yes, I do believe in curses. Oh, okay. In fact, I think it was a curse that sunk the Titanic. What? A curse sank the Titanic. Yeah, look at that face. Yeah. The curse of the Egyptian mummy. Junpei couldn't understand how June had maintained a straight face to say that. Supposedly, the Titanic carried the mummy of the priestess Amon Ra, which was stolen from a pyramid. And they say that the mummy had a history. Ooh. Ooh. Everyone involved with it died mysterious deaths. Come on, I'm sure you've heard of it before. Those who open the coffin will be forever cursed. That's just like the regular just like yeah. course of action for just stealing mummies. Though. Yeah, well, <laughs> option number one, don't open fucking tombs. Number one, coffins. don't go around grave robbing. Yeah, haven't you heard that one? Have you heard the rumors, Kitty? Haven't you heard the rumors? So, you're saying the Titanic sunk because of that curse? That's right! <laughs> June's eyes had lit up with excitement. Like a child with a new toy. She fucking loves conspiracy theories. Oh, shit. Um, that's stupid. I don't buy it. He's fucking scared. It's true. Oh, hey, we have a cat buddy here. Hey, Yanta. Are you gonna sniff the shoes? Uh, how can you be so sure? He loves my shoes. Freaking that mummy wasn't silly just cat. a normal mummy. It was really mysterious. Totally unbelievable. What is so unbelievable about it? Well, supposedly, she was really pretty. Pretty? Yes. But she was a mummy. That's right. She wasn't all shriveled up or rotten or anything. She looked just like she was alive. 
Oh, I get it. They preserved her really well. Yeah. Or she was a fake. It's that thing. I don't remember the name. Where your body turns into some kind of wax? If a dead body is put in the right sort of environment, the fat in it and the fat in it turns into something kind of like candle wax, right? And, uh... Yes, saponification. But that's not what it was. Huh? That's not it. She wasn't wax. Then what, what, what was it? They say that she was frozen. What? Okay, that's You took... know, that Disney movie. That was a lip in logic there, wasn't there? It was, it's that Disney movie, you know, with uh, what's her name and, and Dina Menzelis and whatever her name is. <laughs> what? Frozen? That's I was always right. really more of a DreamWorks kind of guy. Shrek 5 Life. God damn it. The whole body was frozen solid. You know how a human body is more than 60% water, right? Well, all of that water was frozen. The story says that from the time of its discovery all the way through to when it was put in the Titanic, and even though and even though it was carried through the desert, her body never melted. Juin and Junpei talked a little more, and then went back to their investigation. And Junpei promptly forgot all of this shit. Yeah, it's not important. Absolutely not. Not relevant to the story at all. But even as they did, his mind went back to what she had told them. Eyes that wouldn't melt, even in the desert. Could such a thing really exist? No, even if it did, it wouldn't really be ice anymore, would it? It's called Never Melt Ice from yeah. Pokemon. Yeah, to yeah absolutely. Mm -hmm. You know what? I'm sure I'm sure Dark Rise behind all of this. Yep. The more he thought about it, the more his head hurt, because he's really dumb. Bye, Yanto. Like he'd eaten his ice cream ice cream too fast. Alright. Uh Chug it. I you're you're Oops. on the wrong side. Right. Chug it. It's a bottle with water in it. This is a bedroom. They probably have it here because your throat always feels dry when you wake up, you know? <laughs> My throat's dry, but I think that's because I'm a little nervous right now. I'm a little nervous. I'm a little nervous. Well, we did run a lot, so we're kind of sweaty. Hey, Jumpy, did you want to take a shower together? Whoa! Hee, <laughs> just kidding. Terrible. Too late to take it back. My brain's already working out the picture. Wah, 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 wah. Mm. My throat was dry already. This sure wasn't helping. Uh, you should double check that water though. The water? Yeah. It's so, uh, I doubt it'll be. It'll be there. Okay. Well, I guess not. Uh, turn around. To the vanity. Oh, oh, there's a thing with the lock. Oh, there's a key. <gasps> there's a key inside the thing. I found a key. Dresser key. A key. Do you think it's the key to the dresser? What dresser? Oh. oh what? Uh, yeah. There's nothing inside. Oh no. Oh, bro, no. Uh. What? This is the mirror for the dresser. And now she's playing with her hair. Does she even realize she's doing that? Uh, hey. Oh. Uh, 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 we don't have time for that. Because the timer went off. <laughs> Come on, it's not like there's anyone here you need to impress. Yes, there is. Baka. Uh, who? Dot, dot, dot. What? Why are you so quiet all of a sudden? Ugh, forget it, Jumpy. These two just want to bone so hard. Let uh, them bone. The well polished mirror out. Go up. That closes it. There you go. Yeah. Okay. And uh, what am I? Uh, oh. Uh, you already opened that. That's where you got the, the key from. I know. There's nothing inside. But where does the key go? Uh, it's, the key is right there. But where is the? Oh, where I does the key? I go? don't know. The chair that goes with the dresser. There's nothing particularly interesting. I don't know. You want to go to the bathroom, take a shower together? Okay. You know? Sounds good. Yeah. Yeah. Totally. Oops. Maybe on the next episode for the time. Oh no. They just takes us back. Yeah. No. Oh, let's, let's go to the shower. Oh. Well, I guess we're gonna have to well, wait until the next episode to see where this, where this takes us for the time being. Thank you for watching and playing along. You know the usual drill. Come back tomorrow for some more 9 and 9 and then go do a goodness. Mm -hmm. Leave a comment, leave a like. It really does mean a, the world to us. And we hope to see you uh, next time. Next time. We're gonna go find that shower. Yeah. And take a shower. Yeah. <laughs> That's totally not a door right there at the end of the hall, but oh, hey. Shit, look at that.